This video recording is for AMD who missed the live um, lesson with Mr. Ardle on um, creating decals in Inventor. Okay, um, first of all to explain what a decal is, many products that you'll get will have um, images on them or labels on them um, going around them um, that you want to try and create. So for example, um, if I open up the barrel pen which we created in Inventor earlier in the year. Um, if you actually were to look at a real barrel pen it will have the barrel label on this and we can actually do that by having the, the label as a, as a bitmap or a, a JPEG or whatever as a, as a picture and we can actually wrap it around this and that's what's called creating a decal on this. Now this is something that you could be asked to do in your course assignment where you may be asked to actually create a decal on something. So what I'm going to do is demonstrate in several occasions here how you could do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a decal onto this part. Now this is my assembly which is, has got the case, the inkwell, the grip, the nib and the cap. I want the decal to actually take place on the case. So I'm going to double click on the case so I'm only working on the case at the moment. And I'm going to create a work plane. Now the work plane is going to be um, off the front of this object. So I'm going to choose work plane and I'm going to choose one of the default work planes. So I'm going to choose one of the ones which goes down through the center, either that YZ or the, the XY. I think the YZ works better for me. So I'm going to choose that, but I'm going to drag it so that it's off the front here. I'm not really too worried about the size as long as it's off the front and click tick. And I'm going to start a sketch on this work plane. Now what I would then do is I would go and find the image. Now up here you can insert an image. Now I've already got the barrel label already created here so I'm just going to do open and I just click where I want it to come in. Now straight away you can see it's upside down. Now the beauty here in Inventor, you can use the handles on the corners to rotate it. So if I was to take that, or I could use rotate, I'm just going to quite simply choose this corner here. I'm going to drag it round so that it's like so. I'm going to leave it like that. And then I'm going to use this corner here to move it to where I want. Now notice that it stretches above and it stretches below that. I don't have to have it um, the right size and I'll explain why in a second. So I'm going to finish sketch. And now what I'm going to do is decal this label onto the here. So I up in the create, there is a decal. First of all, it's asking for what is the image. This is the image. It's now asking for what face do you want to do it onto. And I'm going to say wrap to face. I'm going to wrap it onto this face here and OK. So we can see what it does. Is it takes that rectangular image and wraps it around the object. Now this workplace is this work plane is still here, so I'm going to right click on top of that and turn off the visibility. I'm going to click return and you can now see that I've got in my object I've got this barrel label which is on that. Now the, the actual quality of the image will be determined by the quality of the image that you bring in. If this was in the NSQA course assignment, they would give you the the, the image to decal onto something. Um, if you're making this yourself, you could go into the internet and find any image at all. So this is one that I found on the internet for the barrel. So if I show you another example of this, a file open, this time instead of the barrel pen, I'm going to open um, a water bottle. This might be something you recognise um, if you did this in third year graphic communication. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and put a label around this that is Highland Spring Water. So once again, double click so it's only this part. I'm going to create a work plane which comes off the front of the object. This time I'm going to choose this work plane, drag it off so it's at the front and I'm going to say start a sketch on that work plane. So bring my image in. Once again I found the Highland Spring logo. I'll open it up and I'll drop it in. This time it's came in pretty well. Again, it stretches beyond it. I'm not worried about that. I am then going to say decal. There's the image I want to decal. 
Face is now highlighted. I'm going to say wrap to face. There's the face. OK. And you can see what happens as the Helen Spring logo wraps around it. I'll turn off the visibility of the, the work plane. And then I'll click return. And now I've got my shape with my label all the way around it. So that's the second um, version of doing a decal. I'll do one last one. Uh, I'll open up the uh, third product that I've got in here, which is the Miracle Grow bottle. And I'll open up the assembly. So what I'm going to try and do here is wrap a label around here that's got the Miracle Grow logo on it. So again, double click on the component you want to wrap it around. I'm going to create a work plane, which is off the front of it. So I'll drag that out from here. I'll say I want to start a sketch on that work plane and then I bring in my image and here's my logo. Now this one is exceptionally large so what I'm going to do is I'm going to make it smaller and I'm also going to rotate it at the same time. So if I do that and then I use this corner here just to bring it in. Now I'm just going to make it even smaller and that's still too big for me. So I'm just going to bring it down like so. Put it there like that and finish sketch. And once again, I do a decal, click on this, face, click on this, and you can see what happens as it wraps around it. Turn off my visibility, click return. I've now got my water sprinkler with the Miracle Grow logo on it. So that was three very quick examples of how to do decals, which is putting an image onto something. Other types of decals that you could do is if you have maybe the walls of a room, you could put posters onto the walls, a poster that you maybe find on the internet as an image, and what you could then do is decal it onto the wall. You would do exactly the same thing. You would select the individual wall, create a work plane off the front of it, create a sketch, sketch the, the object or insert the object using image, and then decal it onto the wall. OK, I hope this demonstration of um, decals was interesting to you. Um, unfortunately, because of the, the lockdown at the moment, you aren't able to use Inventor um, unless you've got it at home. But when we get back into school, whenever that is, um, we'll have a go at doing each of these three exercises where you actually get to do the decal of the barrel pen, the Highland Spring Water and also the Miracle Grow. OK, thanks very much for listening.